The Discovery Church. Welcome to week two of the Bible Engagement Project. And man, I hope you enjoyed last week. Our It's our introduction last week about our journey together. And here we are starting actually in Genesis chapter one, Genesis chapter two. And I hope you enjoyed the video. I thought it was well done. Um, so this week, we're going to be diving into, obviously, Genesis 1 and 2, uh, but we're also going into Romans chapter 1, talking about how that nature expresses the character of the Creator and God our Father. And then also, uh, John 1 is a great, great passage on in the beginning was the Word. And so just dive into that. Take your time. And uh, let it marinate, meditate on these scriptures, let it sink in. I've always said that if we don't take time to do it right, when are we going to take the time to do it over? So here we are in Genesis talking about creation. So take your time and uh, walk through this uh, week slowly, okay? Five days to walk through the scripture slowly. Let it sink in. So Genesis uh, chapter 1 uh, and 2 is day 1, talking about creation, uh, day two, we're going to dive into John 1, 1 through 5. In the beginning was the Word. And then day three, we're going into 2 Corinthians uh, chapter 13, where Paul is talking about creation. And then day four, uh, take some time here just to navigate through these verses in chapter 1, talking about creation and how that creation took a U-turn, uh, his own creation uh, rejected him as God, but that all of creation is proof that God exists. It's just an awesome chapter and verse. And then day five, one of my favorite passages out of the entire New Testament, that all things were created for him and by him, and he holds all things together by his powerful word, it means he can hold everything. If he can hold the universe together, he can certainly hold you and me together. It's so awesome. Day five is going to be great. And then uh, just kind of a, a tagline that I'd like to say to end off this uh, short intro video towards week two of our Bible Engagement Project is why don't we have it a goal to go out and make the invisible God visible? What a great, great opportunity we have from us. Also, you know, we live in such a great area. Go out and just give praise to God uh, this week. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to get up early, going to take a hike, and just take that time of devotion and praise Him uh, out in the middle of His creation. We love you guys. God bless.